I've had more than a few people um, contact me who feel they're under psychic attack, um, under threat of astral entities, and having disturbances in their sleep, etc. And wanting to know what they can do about it. And there's a number of things that we can do about it. At the risk of getting ahead of ourselves, because I don't really want to get into the true nature of these things just yet, but there are a number of things that you can do. The first of which is to banish, banish, and banish again. Now I know that I've stressed the importance of grounding exercises such as the middle pillar, but banishing is just as, if not more, important. So you should be doing some form of banishing ritual in addition to the middle pillar. In fact, the entire neophyte grade, that is the initial grade, is nothing but practicing banishing and grounding. My personal routine um, during that grade was to come into temple. I had a single candle at that time, so I would light my candle, I would light my incense, I would do my relaxation exercises and self-hypnosis to get myself into that trance relaxed state. I would then cast a circle. I would then do a visualization exercise um, where you imagine yourself getting larger and larger and larger until the universe is at your feet. Then I would do the Kabbalistic cross and lesser banishing ritual of the pentagram. After that I would do the evocation of the archangels is all simultaneously one ritual basically. I would then do the middle pillar. I would then do my meditation on a point. I would then do my meditation on a tarot card and I would end with the Kabbalistic cross and then I would declare the temple closed and I was done. 